Hey you, welcome to Unknown G5 beginner course learning tutorials. <laughs> uh, so to continue after our last lesson right now, I mean if you haven't watched the last lesson, there should be probably something around here that you can watch. It's about tiling and shifting the texture. So to continue that off, what if we could add a texture or blend this texture with another texture? Then let's do that. So this is the texture we're having right now. I'm just going to head and um, use something randomly. Probably, um, I don't know. Probably this one should be good. Or you know what? I I feel like we can use this one too. Let's see. Yeah, it's not that bad. Yeah, it's got a lot of variations. Okay. Um, so, to blend these two together, first of all, uh, there's, there's an option for you. If you want to change the material's color, there's an option for you. So hold M on your keyboard and left click for multiply or simply uh, type in multiply or in the palette in here. Uh, multiply and hold 3 on your keyboard and left click you have a 3 way constant and um, the default value will be um, so and right click on it convert to parameter and type color we'll then um, use this one in material instances so instead of this one we'll just hook this one up Okay, so now the colors changed. Let's see. So we have the option to um, change the color in real time in here if we want white, if we want it to be like a little bit more dark. We can do so using the color scheme that I told you. So this is it. What if, you know, add if we use add like if we add this texture to this texture, let me show you. It will literally add them together. So it will add both uh, the texture and the color. So it will be probably, I mean, most in most cases, it will be really, really bright with uh, both textures at the same time in the scene. So, but on the other hand, multiply means um, it literally multiplies these two textures together, so it will show what's common between these two textures together. Let's see what's common between these two. Okay, interesting. So because this is mostly white, it's like... It's like we are almost playing one value to this one. That's interesting. So yeah, this is another way to do it. Use a multiply uh, to combine two textures together. Oh yeah, we have to use the tiling too. And we, I mean, the last, the old texture is basically gone because it's so white that we can't use it that much. But anyway, um, so we have these two, cool, right? We can um, use multiply to color. We can then use add, adds basically, uh, so let me show you. If you want to make it even more bright, adds what you're going to use, let me see. Um, okay, so the, f the next thing that I'm going to show you is called LERP. LERP is, is really, really important. Uh, linear interpolate. Or you can hold L on your keyboard and just left click. So LERP means that we have a texture or something 
going to alpha, we have something going to uh, B. Oh, I'm sorry, to A and then something to B. And then we have an alpha, a mask, basically. So this is like a mask or this one we used right here. So we can use two different textures. I don't know why I deleted that. We can use two different textures at the same time with this mask right here. So let's see how that looks. Um, let's add a color, a black color, so we can visualize it more faster and more clear. Oh, ah, again, I need to do this too. So maybe we use this one as, as something like a really, really big texture. Okay, so as you can see, you can see the macro differences around here. It's blending two textures together so smoothly that you can't really notice much. But if you pay close attention, you will see some deformation here and there. Not deformation, the change in color and the change of pattern. Uh, and that's for LERP. I know it can sound a little bit maybe frustrating when you're first starting Unreal Engine or you're first uh, trying to learn different things, but believe me, this is what you have to learn. These are what I would have had to learn if I had known a little bit more about Unreal Engine. This stuff is really important. So LERP is important, add is so important, multiply is, these three are so important. And that's it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed it, and we're going to talk more about materials in the next episode. Cheers.